Hello grade 11 learners! Welcome back to our video lesson. You are now watching the fourth episode of our quarter 2 video lesson on empowerment technology. On our last video, we talked about the uses and principles in doing infographic. Do you still recall what is an infographic? That's right! Infographic is a visual presentation of information that uses the elements of design to quickly communicate an idea. In this video lesson, we are going to talk about another topic. Are you ready for today's lesson? I know you are. This is Sir Jazil saying, just stay focused. Just be happy. <laughs> And just continue watching our lesson for today. Let's start. Before we begin our lesson, I will be giving you a simple activity. This activity is called Fix Me. Here are the instructions. Broken or incomplete icons of popular social media apps will be presented on the screen. Guess the application's name. Number 1. What do you think is this logo? Amazing! The correct answer is Facebook Let's have the next one What about this logo? What do you think is this logo? Wonderful! The correct answer is TikTok. What about the third one? Can you guess what logo is this? Outstanding! It is What's up? Now, for the fourth one, what about the fourth logo? Very good! It is Messenger. Let's have the last one. Can you tell me what the last logo is? Good job! It is... Instagram. Congratulations everyone! Did you get all of them correctly? That's good! Based on the activity, our topic is connected to the different social media platforms. Our topic for today is all about the Social Power of Social Media. Before we dig deeper into it, I will first present to you our objectives for this lesson. Number 1. Define what is social media. Number 2. Identify the different effects of social media. And number 3. 
identify the statistics of Philippines internet usage. Let's first tackle what is social media. I know you are familiar with the different social media apps and platforms. What do you think is the meaning of social media? Amazing! Social media refers to a computer-based technology that facilitates the sharing of ideas, thoughts, and information through virtual networks and communities. Social media is internet-based and gives users quick electronic communication of content, such as personal information, documents, videos, and photos. Users engage with social media via a computer, tablet, or smartphone via web-based software or applications. Here are some examples. The many social media platforms can be used as a tool, medium, and force in bringing about action and mobilize change in population, society, or culture. It is the fastest way to spread, share, and access information anywhere in the world. It is also a great way to start or publicize an advocacy. What is an advocacy? That's great! Advocacy is the process of supporting and enabling people to express, defend, and promote their rights, concerns, and views. We all know how powerful social media can be. They say that social media can either make or break someone. If you are lucky, you may go viral and be an instant sensation. But on the other hand, you can become the center of attention of many haters. Social media can be an experiment to encourage, communicate, share stories, get opinions, and exercise the freedom of opinion and expression. We are now going to talk about the benefits of social media, especially in advocating or promoting social change. We have the following. Promote social change or advance reforms. Support social justice or create social movements. Access to those who are impoverished, hurting, left out, or victims. Stop bullying or discrimination. Help during calamities and tragedies. Allow people to have responsibility to engage as citizens. Those are the different effects of social media in our lives. Do you think social media is really a powerful platform? That's correct. Social media is really a powerful platform, especially in our time because of its wide influence around the world. To prove that social media have so much influence, especially here in our country, we have here the on the internet usage of Filipinos. This is according to the AGB Nielsen Philippines. Did you know that? Number one, the Philippines ranked second highest for the number of people who had ever liked or followed a brand, company, 
or celebrity on social networking sites. Close to one quarter of Filipino internet users access the internet on a daily basis via mobile phone, and 56% intend to access the internet via mobile phone in the next 12 months. 43.5% of Filipinos access the internet, 5% points higher than Southeast Asian regional average of 38%. Fifty-two percent of Filipinos had a computer with high-speed internet connection at home. Over two-thirds of Filipino digital consumers had visited social networking sites compared to 40 percent who used email. Our country may be small, but based on the data presented, we have a very large amount of social media users around the world. We are considered to be one of the most active social media users. We can now say that social media really have a large influence in the world we are living in. We should always remember the saying, Think before you click. It's easy to say words on social media because we do not interact with them personally. But we should always remember the things we say, the photos we share, and videos we upload may remain in the internet forever. We should always be careful and be respectful with other people. Did you understand our topic for today? I know you did. Now, let's test your understanding of our topic. I will be giving you another activity. Statements will be shown on the screen. Tap the heart icon if your answer is true and tap the like icon if it is false. Write your answers in the comment box below. Are you ready? Okay, let's go! Number 1 Social media refers to a computer-based technology that facilitates the sharing of ideas, thoughts, and information through virtual networks and communities. Is it heart or like? Perfect! It is heart because this statement is true. Number 2 The Philippines ranked second highest for the number of people who have ever liked or followed a brand, a company, or celebrity on social networking sites. Is this a heart or a like? Awesome! It is also a heart because this statement is also true. Number 3 Social media does not promote social change or advance reforms. Did you tap on the heart or like button? Great! This statement is false, so it should be the like button. Next statement. 43.5% of Filipinos access the internet 5% points higher than the world's regional average of 38%. Did you tap on the heart or like button? Perfect! This statement is also false. 
So it should be the like button. For the last one, social media helps in accessing those who are impoverished, hurting, left out, or victims. Is this a heart or a like? Awesome! It is a heart because this statement is true. Congratulations everyone! Did you answer all of them correctly? That's good! That's it for our topic for today. Did you learn something from this episode? I know you did! See you again in our next video lesson. This is Sir Jazil saying, just stay focused. Just be happy. And just wait for our next Ayos at Munoz e episode. Bye!